There have been days of eager anticipation prior to this gargantuan clash, but now we need talk about it no more and instead focus on the here and now. A match that has the capacity to delight and dazzle no matter who you support. Two high-level sides ready to go at it. It's Barcelona, they face Paris Saint-Germain and it's coming up live here on EA TV. Hello from the Catalan capital and one of the world's great cities, Barcelona. My name is Derek Ray and sitting alongside me in the commentary position is the former Arsenal and West Ham midfield player Stuart Robson. And what we have to look forward to is the second leg of this Champions League semi-final. It's Barcelona against Paris Saint-Germain. Well, Derek, Barcelona have a slender lead from that first leg. But unless they stay focused today and don't drop too deep, this could be a really tough game for them. I'm looking forward to this one. Promising move from Barcelona. But a good piece of defending to bring it to an end. And the Barcelona shape looks like this. Marc-André Ter Stegen starts in goal. Frenkie de Jong plays alongside Ilkay Gundogan in central midfield. And getting the vote of confidence in attack today, Robert Lewandowski. Mbappe introducing the Paris Saint-Germain starters. Gianluigi Donnarumma is the keeper. Marquinhos plays alongside Lucas Hernandez in central defence. And lining up through the middle in attack today is Kylian Mbappe. And a shooting chance for Lewandowski. And the goalkeeper covered a lot of ground to push that away from danger. Dembele. An exciting talent who has everything a forward needs to be successful. Stuart, what are you expecting to see from Mbappe? Well, he's been brilliant for them. He's their leading goal scorer and his general play in the top third of the pitch has been so clever. I'm really looking forward to seeing him play today. Marquinhos. Mbappe with it. The defenders know they need to get tighter. Could be! And a decent save, full credit. Joao Felix. Vitor Ferreira. Manuel Ugarte. And it's opening up. Well, couldn't put it away. Couldn't square the game. Well, that was a great opportunity. They should really be level now. Rafinha. Gundogan. Lewandowski. Oh, what an opportunity. Not to be for him. He went for power over placement. Well, you're right. He decided to go for the power, which in the end he couldn't control. He'll be furious with himself. That's a big miss. High pressing at its best. Dembele, just the challenge that was required. Rafinha. Kunde. On to Gundogan. Chance to play it in. Well played in from the flag, but not to any great effect. And that will be a Barcelona ball. Frankie de Jong. Well, racing past his man. But no damage done, that's the main thing. Dembele. Hakimi. Mbappe. Cover up. 
And a time for cool heads. Lewandowski. Here's Rafinha. De Jong. Well, the fans want to see a shot. And he stopped them in their tracks. But it stopped a promising attack in its tracks. And you wouldn't be surprised if there's a card coming out here. And he does produce the yellow card. Yeah, and it certainly deserved a yellow. It's a poor challenge, you have to say. Trying to open them up. Oh, it's off the post! On a time for composure on the ball. Lewandowski. He's in with a chance. And first class defending cleared off the line. De Jong. And now was Joao Felix. And with that, they've thwarted the opportunity. Joao Felix has someone to play it to oh denied by the post but a good strike yeah really good strike hits the back of the ball hits it with power just not the accuracy required good high press Mbappe Marquinhos good tackle take it away and threading it through oh genuine chance and a goal and I'll tell you what that gives them a bit of a cushion now Well, just look how Lewandowski glides past his opponent and then Lewandowski's finish is brilliant. He strikes the ball so cleanly and gives the keeper no time to react. It's a really good goal. So the match has restarted. 1-0 here. Marquinhos. Vitor Ferreira. Now, what can Paris Saint-Germain do from this position? In with a chance! Well, a classic example of how to intercept. Outrageously skillful. But a good piece of tidying up. Will he finish? Well, not the easiest of saves, but you'd expect him to stop it. Short corner taken. Well, he passed the power test. Shame about the accuracy. Rafinha. Committed challenge. And support available. Wonderful chance. And a goal. And now the question is, can they come up with one more? Well, I have to say, he's done really well here. He's in the right place and then a decent finish. That's a good goal. Back underway, level pegging, one goal apiece in this game. A really committed challenge, and it's gone out for a throw-in. And we will have just one additional minute.
into the advanced position. And they've bought themselves a bit of time. Can he convert? Well, fantastic reflex action from the goalkeeper. Fired over by Usman Dembele. A chance then for the respective managers to address their charges. It is half-time here. Well, underway once more, and it's going to be fascinating to see what developments occur in this second half. Cancelo. And here's Joao Felix. Well, all doing their bit to keep them out. Lucas Hernandez. Mensch. Ugarte. Mbappe. Plenty of players waiting in the middle. Pulls it back. Well, it looked as though it had a chance of going in. Well, he should make the keeper work there, but you sense a goal is coming. PSG are going to switch things around on the personnel front. Frankie de Jong. Koundé. And Barca moving the ball with purpose. But nothing comes of it. Mensch. Ugarte. Here's Marquinhos. Dembele. And continues his run. The delivery from Dembele. Well, when all was said and done, he's failed to hit the target. Romeu. And the ball with Christensen. Kunde, a oh, nice ball over the top. Gundogan, given away by Barcelona. And we have 30 minutes to go. Opportunity here, and now it is there for him, and a goal. And I'll tell you what, that gives them a bit of a cushion now. things stand Hernandez here's Marquinhos Dembele space afforded PSG and teammates to play it to took a really smart piece of defending to stop them running with the ball confidently and a decent save full credit Rafinha, well, spot on with that challenge. 
Oh, super piece of play. Asensio. Really fine piece of defending play to break us up. Frankie de Jong. And he's in. And it's there for him. And it's two for him today. A masterful performance. The defenders unable to stop it. We can take another look at how close this was. It was marginally over the line, yes, but no doubt it was a goal. Well, the action continues, and no shortage of goals. 3-1 as things stand. Marco Asensio. Might have been Marco Asensio. And it went sailing over the crossbar. Not a moment he'll want to remember. Joao Cancelo. Fine work from Paris Saint-Germain to win the ball back. Dembele and there it breaks down but credit to the defence might be able to get in behind the defence it's a perfect challenge fifteen minutes left for play Plenty of support here. Dembele. Oh, that's really untidy. Oh, yes! It's gone in! And now a chance for them to revel in the moment. Well, as you can see, he hits this with so much power, but just look at the follow-through. So athletic. That's a dynamic strike. You can't really say defences are on top. 3-2. Romeo. On to De Jong. Joao Cancelo. Christensen. Araujo. Jules Kunde on the ball. Well, a growing sense of frustration. Just can't get near the ball. Mbappe. This looks more than decent. Mbappe! They're making this interesting, but do they have enough time? Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. And once he gets onto it, there's only going to be one outcome. It's a lovely goal. Back underway, and quite the story being written in this one. Three all. Oriol Romeu on the ball Joao Felix five minutes of the 90 still to go and the teams cannot be separated good work from PSG to win it back what can he do with it now giving them a different option by moving in field clears it away Effective piece of pressing. Gundogan. Feeding it through. Well, it nearly worked out on a fine interception. Marquinhos. Ugarte. 
Asensio. Really good build up, but no end product. Joao Felix. Well, the referee has instructed the book. And Robert Lewandowski on the move here. Well, it might still work out for them. Gundogan gives it a go. Marquinhos with the block. De Jong. Now with Lewandowski. And that's it, the referee's whistle. Barcelona will be in the final. Well, there really wasn't much in it over the two legs, was there? They just had that bit more quality all over the park, and it showed in the end. Looking forward to the next round now.